Hello, Gotham Bank. I am going to be robbing you, so put your hands up before you die. Who do you think you are? Coming in here and acting like you can boss us around. Batman will stop you. Oh, Batman. Batman will stop me? Ha! Huh. Did you really think I would be that stupid? Nobody knows I'm here. Well, I know you are here, you idiot. That can be a problem. A problem with a simple solution. Now give me all the money. Yeah, yeah, yes, sir. Please don't hurt me. Now to leave my note for Batman. <laughs> What does this mean? What is the most ironic place to be injured at? It's a hospital. Ah, what do you mean hospital? It's the answer to the riddle. The most ironic place you can be injured at is a hospital. So are you saying he's at the hospital? No, the camera show that he's physically okay. Okay, but what does this have to do with the hospital? I don't know, but I will go check it out. Well, you do that and he's gone. Doctor, did anyone who likes riddles leave recently? Yes, Batman. Someone did. We had about five people who like riddles leave. Okay, let me rephrase that. Did a crazy person who likes riddles leave recently? We, we have two people that fit that description, but I can't tell you. Who are they? Well, one is named Paul Gorshin. The other is named Edward Nigma. Tell me more about Edward. He was obsessed with Riddles and Bruce Wayne. He always said he was the next Bruce Wayne. Thank you, Doctor. Alfred, I think I know who the Riddler is. Really, Master Bruce? I think his name is Edward Nigma. I'm going to cross-check it with our data. It seems that I used to be my employee. I sent him to a mental institution after he was caught sneaking outside the mansion. I remember that. Please continue, Master Bruce. Before he entered the institution, I told him that when he was better, he could continue working for me. I wonder if he's going to show up at Wayne Enterprises. Well, I guess we'll just have to see what happens, Master Bruce. Would you like me to see if Master Grayson will help you, sir? Batman works alone. Uh, I'm not leaving until I get my old job back. Bruce Wayne told me that when I get better, I could get it back. Well, I don't believe you. Now get out. What is the problem here, Mr. Stickley? Edward Enigma has returned, Mr. Wayne. Welcome back, Edward. Are you feeling better? Oh, yes, Mr. Wayne. I'm feeling fine. Well, Edward, I left your cubicle the same. Thank you, Mr. Wayne. And Edward? Yes, Mr. Wayne? I hope I don't find you sneaking on my bushes anymore, Edward. Of course. Alfred, I'm coming over to the back cave via the office tunnel. I'll be expecting you, sir. I was right, Alfred. He did show back up. What did you do about it, sir? I had to keep my word, Alfred. Batman knows he broke out of the hospital. Bruce Wayne doesn't. I can't give him any reason to hate me. I guess you are right, Master Bruce. I'm going out for patrol. Be safe, Master Bruce. What are you doing? N nothing. Why are you taking the Batmobile's tires? To, to sell them? Why? I want the money. What's your name? J Jason Todd. Come with me, Jason. Why are you showing me this? I need a sidekick after Robin left. And you want me to be Robin? Exactly. It would be so cool to be Robin. You can if you want to. You mean it? Yes, I do, Jason. Thank you so much, Batman! I need to tell you something first. Okay. My name is Bruce Wayne. Are you ready, Robin? Y yes. Don't be nervous, Robin. Okay. Robin, take out the driver. Okay. What the heck?
back, Batman. Where's the Riddler? I... I don't know who you're talking about. Let me handle this. Who are you, Bird Boy? No, I'm Robin. Robin, stop this! But this is how we get answers. No, this is not how you do it. You almost killed him. We do not kill people. I'm sorry, Batman. The police are coming. Let's go. Jason, what you did was unacceptable. You can't go around almost killing people. I'm sorry, but if they don't die, then they will come back again. Then they can have a life of constant regret when they get older. Oh, you said something. Gotham City, riddle me this, riddle me that. Who's afraid of the big black bat? <laughs> I want to see Batman at City Hall in the next hour, or else I blow it up! This was the scene outside of City Hall just moments ago. The mayor has called for a citywide evacuation. Jason, get down here! Have you forgiven me? Yes, Jason, I have. We need at City Hall. All right. All of you, stop right now! Why should we? Because if you don't, I will make you. Ha! Huh. What are you gonna do, shrimp? Miss. Give up yet? Never! Get down! Robin, what is this? How am I supposed to know? It says, look up. Surprise! Riddler! Riddle me this, Batman. What can't see well but hear great? And flies in the sky alongside the moonlight. Let me guess. A bat. Exactly! <laughs> Dang it! He got away again. Let's go see if we can track him at the bat cave. How could I be so careless? Stop yelling, sir. We have guests upstairs. Tell them to leave. I need to think of ways to stop Riddler. Why don't you call Edward by his real name, sir? Because maniacs don't have real names. I will make you proud, Bruce. It's over, Riddler. Is Batman with you? I only deal with real heroes. I am a real hero. Huh, I thought you were smarter than that. You think Batman taught you anything? <laughs> Alfred! Yes, sir. Riddler has Jason. How, sir? He went at it alone and got caught. Now Riddler is demanding I unmask myself in front of everyone, or else Jason gets launched into space on a bomb that is going to hit Gotham. Oh my, Master Bruce. Whatever are you going to do? Everything I can. He just had to try to fight Riddler on his own. He just had to prove himself to me. Maybe he wanted to get it done, sir, so you can move on to other things. I bet he's trying to do something to prove himself. Would you like me to go call Master Grayson, sir? No. Nightwing has enough stuff going on in Bloodhaven. But, sir... No! I will handle it! I have to. Time to save Jason. Respect your elders, kid. I want you alive for when Batman shows up. <laughs> and what if he doesn't? What will you do then? You, my little friend, will get to see Earth from a new point of view. You're crazy. And you're too young for this. And you're too stupid. I'm taking you down, Riddler. No! You can't do this to me! I'm sorry, Edward. I'm sorry about this, Batman. Don't be. If it wasn't for the tracker in your suit, I wouldn't have found you or Riddler. Oh. Let's get back to the Batcave, Robin. You did good, Jason. 
How? You stood in the face of danger and did not give up. That is what makes you, Jason, the perfect Robin. You mean it? Yes, Jason. I do mean it. Thank you. You will not regret this. I know. This is the greatest day of my life. Today, Batman and his sidekick Robin have stopped the mysterious Riddler. We don't have all the information, but when we get it, you will know. In other news, Victor Freeze, a scientist at Gotham University, has had a tragic accident today. He fell in a pit of liquid nitrogen. His entire body has been frozen to the bone. We'll have more on this at 10 p.m. <laughs>